Good morning guys. As promised, we are exploring a little bit of El Paso today. Went to the gym, took some showers, and now we are at the Scenic Overlook on Scenic Drive. And we came up here because we're supposed to get a view of the entire El Paso area, which you do. It is way bigger than I thought. It's way huge. bigger. It's huge. Yeah, check this out. It's huge. So this isn't all El Paso. We're just looking it up. That red X over there, called the X, symbolizes the blood spill from the brutal Juarez drug wars and actually is in on the border um, in Mexico. And so the Rio Grande River runs right there and everything on the other side is actually Mexico. stop for diesel on our El Paso mini tour. Found diesel for $2.58, which is crazy cheap. Um, haven't filled up since Tucson, so needed to fill up before we start heading away tomorrow. Meanwhile, Steve is going to make everything better for you and clean the windshield. We'll make for a better video later. Oh, and we use Gas Buddy, the app, to find the cheapest diesel anywhere we go. It was like $2.99 by the casino where we are camped, but since this was on the way to where we're going and it was $2.58, worth it. So right under this highway, right there, that's the wall with Mexico. So the cars over there, Mexico, not on this highway. So this is a free monument and visitor center run by the National Park Service. It's a monument to cooperation. When you base a border on a river, sometimes you have problems because the river course changes, you have flooding, and then who owns what? That is what this memorial is kind of about and about how eventually the U.S. and Mexico had to settle peacefully where the actual border was and not base it on the Rio Grande. There were a lot of not so peaceful disputes before that. There is a sister memorial on the other side of the border. We won't be going to that one today. <laughs> That's true. <we> won't. <laughs> so that is the Chamizal, I'm probably saying that wrong, National Monument here in El Paso, or at least the El Paso American I'm not gonna try to say it because <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> it's very interesting though. I didn't know about um, how like the surveys to, to actually pick where the border was going to be and then how there was this huge dispute here in El Paso because the river moved and it's kind of hard to make a border be a river. Those darn moving rivers. <laughs> so very interesting that it wasn't even really fully settled until the 60s and at that point they had to like move people and even though it was a peaceful settlement there were still people. Still who people who were uprooted. Yeah. yeah I got, generations in the same house had to leave and everything. But um, yeah, it's kind of one giant city between Juarez and El Paso with the border crossing. The Bridge of Americas that we saw is actually right here. Like you can see it from where we're standing. It's a stone's throw, yeah. yeah. That red X is- Also right on the other side. Three, 400 yards, yeah. Yeah, pretty cool. So uh, yeah, I think we're going to head back towards the Airstream. My, my arm's getting tired. Go through downtown and show you before we hit a brewery for happy hour a little bit later. Cool. The other thing we didn't say is that this memorial has huge park grounds and you can have picnics and they have plaques different places so it's kind of a cool place. Yeah. Looks like this. That was that was your quick tour. Oh man the gold you get on a stream in life. Mm-hmm. 
that's kind of neat. It's a shipping container coffee shop over there. Pretty cool. That's Mexico. And this is the wall. <laughs> Looking at border towns like this makes me feel thankful for what we have. It's very true. Last stop on our El Paso tour, Ode Brewery and Kitchen. Our waiter called El Paso the diamond in the rough. I could see that. We have a cucumber colch. Look at that, I'm, I'm looking forward to trying that. What did you get? Rose. Rose? Oh, your usual. I can't drink beer. It's all good. This cucumber is like a punch in the face cucumber, which I like. Good happy hour food. That's cauliflower, it's not chicken. Bread. Did you enjoy yourself? I did. That strawberry beer that they had was fantastic. We're leaving tomorrow from El Paso. We're going to boondocking right by Carlsbad Caverns. Yeah, hopefully we'll get to see Guadalupe Mountains, Carlsbad Caverns. Fun times. We're looking forward to it. Out of the parking lot into dirt. Yeah. We'll see what it's like. Free dirt. Yeah. Yeah. Say goodnight. Say goodnight. Or goodbye. 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 See you tomorrow.